Hello YouTube. Uh, today I wanted to take a brief moment and talk about the fake message that people are getting that says service vary on the iPhone 6, 6S Plus, iPhone 7 and iPhone 8. So I have found a way to work around this. This is how I found it out. So I, um, I ordered a, a, an aftermarket battery online and when I received the battery I put it into the iPhone and I got a message that says service battery for that battery that that new battery that I just received. So I found out that the way to work around this is actually to when you receive the battery, it's usually there's a little bit of charge, maybe 10%, 20%, whatever percentage is in there. So use the phone, do not charge the battery to 100% yet. If you're getting a service battery message, as soon as you install the battery, drain the battery to 0%. So use the phone until the battery dies completely. And then after you've done that, then charge the battery to 100%. And if it doesn't work, um, drain the battery again to zero and then charge it again and see if that works so that's the way you fix the service the fake service battery message that um, we've been seeing on the iPhones recently I think I started seeing this uh, message in uh, January and I believe that um, Apple released the so software that allows uh, the iOS to be able to tell which battery is an original Apple battery and which one is not an original Apple battery. They're trying to prevent people from buying uh, non-approved, non-Apple batteries. So uh, so when you click on battery health, you'd see a service battery. I've already fixed this one already. So I took out the, the original Apple battery that uh, was giving me a, a, serv a service battery message. And I took that one out and I installed the aftermarket battery and after I installed the aftermarket battery the message over here was service battery so I drained the battery and then I um, I charged it to 100% and then the message to say service battery went away and now the uh, maximum, maximum capacity on this aftermarket battery is now 100% so as you can see this is not an Apple battery and Apple is trying to get rid of people using non-Apple batteries by uh, the software that they release that says that identifies non-Apple products. So I hope this is helpful to you. If it has been helpful to you, uh, please uh, like this video, like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.